Hey everybody, welcome back. So, one of the things that's been trending lately, you know what, has really been the last, I don't know, several years, has been this thing where this company does something that people don't like, and they take their stuff and they go burn it. I, I'm going to be honest with y'all, I, I never, I never really got that. I mean, okay, I get I get that people are mad at a company for taking a stand against something they don't like. Um, in this case, the the latest and greatest car art. So in that case, I, I completely understand. Hey, people feel like, uh, you know, you, you car art, you, you sided with the... The, you know, the big tech oligarchy that's exploiting people for, with with fear and false science and, and even yeah okay I get why people would be upset especially from a brand that really should have been should have known better that's that's what usually when you see this nobody I don't think anybody would have cared if it had been I don't know North Face just just throwing that out there. Um, or, or any other type of uh, a brand that maybe had a more, a less blue collar, less common sense kind of uh, culture around it. But <clears throat> at the same time, this still keeps my head warm. And me burning this doesn't really, doesn't really affect the company. The, the money's already gone, all right? Now, hey, future purchases, yeah, I, I get that. But, okay, I, I do I do understand, like, hey, look, I am not giving you ad space on my friggin' forehead up here. I get that. So, why burn this? When this right here is the offensive part, this, this is just fine. Let's go. I want to show you how to take that off. Uh, real simple tools. It's easy. And you can go have, have yourself a big old party burning these guys if you want. Okay. We're going to be using this tool right here. It's called a seam ripper, seam stripper. I've heard them both. Uh, usually, you'll see a little red ball there. This one doesn't have it. I don't know if it fell off at some point or if uh, just never had it. But we're not even going to be using that part today. We've got usually have a sharp part out here and this dull part, this rounded edge towards the back right there. For this. Because this is a knit cap, trying to trying to run this in there, I'm probably just going to get it caught on the uh, on, on the knit material there. So I'm going to come at it from the top, take my sharp part, and just get it under that stitching and push. And the, right in the back there, so you can see that there's a little sharpened blade right at the right at the crotch of those two pieces of metal. So get underneath the thread. That one just pulled right out and push through to the sharp part. Boom. Well, already I got three stitches out. There's another one. There's another. Oh, I skipped one. Come here. Oh, get them all close together here. I'll come back to that one. Popped out, popped out. I'm not even cutting these, I'm just pulling them through. Popped out, boom, boom. Oh, don't want to get my cap. Boom. Oh, come here, there's another one. And another one. So now I've got this whole side 
got the threads removed. Oh, there we go, cut that one. Get the thread out of there. No, I'm just pulling that now. Not even using the seam stripper, seam ripper, whatever you call it. Once you get those first few done, you can, with most things, but especially with knit stuff where it's, it doesn't hold the thread that well, or doesn't hold it that tightly, you can just pull this right through. There we go. There's a the thread behind it. <clears throat> so, now, rather than burning all of this and just wasting a perfectly good piece of clothing that, I don't know, I just something, something rubs me the wrong way about that. You can take these right here and burn these. While you're at it, why don't you go ahead Invite all your friends over and just make a regular Guy Fox night out of it. And you can all bring your Carhartt logos and whatever other companies you don't like and, and burn those. And, and that way, that way at least you have a friendly get-together and a bonfire over it. And, I don't know, talk about how much you hate these companies or something. Maybe just, I don't know, hang out with your buds. Anyway, that's all I got. Just uh, reminding you, get out there, go do cool stuff. Enjoy nature, and uh, more than anything, y'all take care of each other. All right? That's all I got.